Hello everyone, uh, this is Mohammed Azam. I just wanted to share a new app that I'm working on. It will be available soon on the Apple App Store. Uh, so let me go over the app. It's called Arrived and basically it uses the iBeacons to, um, to locate your stuff. So this is called Arrived. Um, here's the app. Now it doesn't really have anything right now. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to add a picture and I can attach an image. Uh, so I'm going to click on the attach image, play a pick up from the library and going to the camera roll, I'm just going to attach my bag. And let's say you're at the airport and you want to check the bag in. So you're just going to say name, some sort of a name that you will provide, laptop bag. All right. And this is the UDID, which you will actually get from uh, from your iBeacon, whatever you purchase. So you have to enter that. Unfortunately, there's no way for me to display a page where you can actually select the iBeacon's ID. Uh, that is against the Apple rules. So you have to actually manually enter it. I know it's kind of weird, but you have to. Major and minor ID, you can assign different major and minor IDs for my laptop bag. The major and minor ID for the iBeacon that is inside the laptop bag is 1-1. One, one. I'm gonna save it. And here we go. So now I have checked in my laptop bag. It's in the car. It's basically on a flight right now. Um, and then um, basically I just got it to, and then I, go ahead and start doing some other work. Now I'm going to insert a iBeacon, uh, the battery, which will basically simulate that when the car when the baggage will arrive at the carousel. All right, mm -hmm. and here we go. So you get the notification, you clicked on the notification and here we go, it says delivered, all right. And if I remove the iBeacon battery, which is kind of simulating that the iBeacon has gone out of range, maybe, you know, maybe a far away or something, then eventually it will change to, uh, uh, you know, whatever, departed status. Uh, it usually takes um, around two to three minutes to change that. And as you can see, the plus sign, you can add, add multiple items. Of course, common sense, the prerequisite for this app will be that you have iBeacons, okay? And you can get, uh, I'm using KS Technologies iBeacon. They were kind enough to send me that, but you can use KS Technologies. You can use any iBeacon that you want. You can use Estimode. Are you gonna any any iBeacons that you want? And here we go. So now it has departed because I have taken the battery out of the iBeacon, simulating that the iBeacon or the, the bag itself has gone somewhere else. So that's it. The whole source code will be available uh, shortly. I'm still working on it, so minor tweaks. And uh, that's pretty much it. I hope you uh, like this app and then use it on your daily basis um, and, you know, track different things. Thank you very much.